This is the Big O Show. This is the Big O Show. Now, let me tell you something, folks. The other night, we had the whole incident between the Nuggets and the Heat where Markeith Morris ran into Jokic, made no basketball play, and then Jokic retaliated. And he was remorseful after the game, you know. Uh, but in the end, you know, yesterday I told you that I had no problem with what went on with Jokic because. I told you that Markeith Morris brought it on himself. I told you yesterday that if you play any street ball in the park, you're in a fight with that play. Because somebody just running across the court and just rams right into you, and you never know if you're at that moment in, in, in the middle of a, of a step that you could be a little bit off balance and it could knock you out, it could not knock you out, but knock you down. You could get hurt. You could blow out a shoulder, or an elbow, a knee, an ankle, whatever, anything. You could hit your head, have a concussion. You know, anything could have happened to, to, to Jokic at that moment, right? And, and yet, everybody's, you know, part most of a Heat Nation and look, I get it, man. Fans are fans. That's why it's called fans, because you're fanatical. And some of you have no objectivity whatsoever. And, and look, I get it, Heat Nation, all that. And I'm a Heat fan, too, as much as anybody out there. I love the Heat. Been a season ticket holder before I got in this business. I got nothing but respect for the Heat. Markeith Morris got what he deserved. And Markeith Morris, let me explain something to you. He pulled a punk move. One, he charged at a guy and just rammed his shoulder into his chest without making any kind of a basketball move, not trying to do anything, which he could have hurt the guy. And that's what Joker has to think, like, yo, what the hell are you doing? And then he turns his back on him after he hits him. Like, he's going to forget about it. Like, he's not going to hit me with my back turned and all that, right? And then that's when you get pissed, like, F you, dude. And so I would have done the same crap. I would have hit his ass, too. Now, I think Markeith Morris got off because they suspended Joker for a game and, and without pay, which is a lot of money, and they only fined Morris 50K. He deserves to get suspended, too, because he instigated it. So you expect to run your shoulder into someone's chest where you could have hurt them, and then you expect no retaliation, and you expect nothing to come of it. Oh, because that it's what Kenny Smith says. We got to get to playing basketball. That's not basketball. So the way it looks at it, and for you butthurt Heat fans, I don't care, Okay. You're you're just as soft as Robbie Robinson for for Inter Miami, all right. Basically, that's right. You're a soft ass Heat fan if you think this is just Jokic's fault, because what Markeith Morris did was a punk move. If you're gonna push somebody, then face them. Don't go running away and turn your back on them, thinking, "Oh, this part of the game, he's not gonna hit me." I'm glad he got hit in the back. I'm glad he got thrown down to the floor because maybe Markeith Morris will learn not to be a punk on the court. So for me, in my eyes, Markeith is more wrong than Jokic is. Jokic did what any other man should do. You hit me like that, I'm going to hit you no matter what. You want to turn your back because you think I'm not going to retaliate? I'm going to hit you square and knock your ass down. So all this stuff, bottom line is, Markeith got what he deserved. Because that's what happens in street ball. You pull bullshit like that, you deserve to get slammed to the ground. You put people at risk, you deserve to get slammed to the ground. That's the way it needs to be looked at. Markeith Morris 
got what he deserved. Next time, don't pull bullshit like that, Markeith. And maybe that won't happen. Because I know that if you pull that in street ball, you're fighting. Kenny Smith said it. And he's a mild mannered dude. Any of us that have played pickup basketball over the years, you don't do that ever in pickup basketball. That's a fight. That's a fight. At that moment, you know what happens there? You push the guy, he grabs the ball, he throws it at you, and then he's coming at you to fight. That's what's coming. That's what's coming. So for all of you soft ass heat nation, and you know what it is? Most of you that are complaining about it, you've never played a pickup basketball game in your life. And you've never played a tough pickup basketball game in your life. Let's put it that way. Playing that soft ass crap in elementary or something. Go ahead, you go do that in, in a pickup basketball game. See what happens. Yep, Morris thought Jokic was soft. Wrong. Exactly, Ian from Brooklyn. That's exactly it. And the dude sent him a message. And guess what? Nobody's going to do that next time to Jokic because they know that he's going to retaliate. Jokic, Jokic did exactly what he was supposed to do, and Markeith Morris got exactly what he deserves. This is the Big O Show. This is the Big O Show.